Programming. You've heard about it multiple times. Now, what is programming? Maybe all of us know what the terms programming is, but my job here is to further tell you what it is and what you can do with it. Now, let's get one thing straight. Programming is not just about coding. That's on a lighter note. But meanwhile, let us talk about computers because for you to talk about computers, you need to talk about the program that you run in the computer, you know, and vice versa. Now, I would say that when you hear the term computer, I think we shouldn't just think about it as just our desktop computer and our laptop computer. It is way larger than that. Computers can be categorized as the mobile phones that we use, the ATM devices, and even the navigator on our cars. So computers are very, very vast. And you know, my simple way of defining what computers are is just simply anything that can run arithmetic logic. Anything that can follow instruction, that can run a program is a computer. So from the wristwatch that you have to the gadget on your hand to even some trackers that you have even some printing devices are also computers just imagine anything that can run logical instruction which means i can tell it if anything does one two three so so things should happen in fact let me even shock you the lift that you use right the lift that take you up and down is actually a computer because it follows a certain arithmetic so as a result of that is able to carry out one instruction or the other now that you understand various type of computers yeah now let us talk about what is programming now programming in this term is the ability to program certain instructions that solve specific problem and Take for instance, you would have experienced programming in various ways on your social media platform. That social media app that you get to visit almost every day was actually programmed. Is it your e-commerce platform that you get to buy your item? They were actually programmed as well. So there are several elements that we use, including apps on our phone that get to wake up like alarm app on our phones and all of that were actually programmed. Now, when you look at it critically, programming is very broad. It all depends on the aspect you want to venture into. In fact, when you start looking at programming, you begin to look at it from various angles. And for an application to be ready, it needs to go through several layers. You have the product designer, web designer, front end, back end. You have the DevOps and you have the cybersecurity experts who make sure that I mean, your application is not hacked. So programming in a nutshell is something that I think everybody should know how it works. And if I'm to explain this, if I'm to give an illustration of what programming is, I will just refer to a kitchen or somebody trying to prepare a meal, right? So think of it as you trying to cook something. The first thing is you need to make sure that you find a way to bring all of your ingredients together. And once you're sure that you have all the ingredients, you begin to start following the process of preparing that meal. Now you begin to add the items one by one and at some point you get to wait until the food is ready. Now once the food is ready, all you need to do is to serve the food. In our world, in serving the food, it means that hosting it on the cloud and making it available for people to use, which means I can either make my app downloadable and you know make it accessible to anyone regardless of where they are. And that's how we wrap it up on this one. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and follow me on all my social media and until next time i'll see you in the next one